field marshal is waiting for news. I've got reports from four other teams who have successfully destroyed supply convoys. But one team still hasn't checked in. Is everything all right? If the two of you are looking for me, something must have gone wrong. And people say we're pessimists. Nothing is wrong at the moment. No more than usual, at least. But there is an urgent matter that requires your attention. Members of the Dark Council have insisted on sharing their concerns about the hidden chain. Particularly the alarming increase in violent attacks on non-Mandalorian targets. They want a meeting with you. Yesterday, if possible. I don't understand what they're expecting to hear from me. They've got it in their heads that you know something that'll make it all go away, and even if you can't, they want to hear it straight from you. It certainly doesn't help that the increased surveillance of Shay's movements has provided nothing useful since she disappeared. We had some of our best people telling her. But if Mandalore the Avenger doesn't want to be found... Her absence during all of this has the potential to paint that in a very poor light. Then do whatever you have to do to find her. No excuses. We're doing our best, but tracking down Shay isn't going to happen overnight. Uh, speaking of, looks like our delay tactics didn't work. They're more insistent than I thought. I'll find a suitable room for the meeting. Everything will be ready when you are. Kind of you to spare us a moment of your time. Your associates were adamant that there was no way to work this discussion into your schedule. No matter how many times I reminded them of your commitment to the Dark Council. You and I share something that few others can truly understand. What it means to lead. To be the one who must make the hardest decisions. Like how to deal with assets who create more trouble than they are worth. I've dispatched a task force to monitor the activity of these hidden chain Mandalorians, as well as those who oppose them. They tread perilously close to violating Imperial jurisdiction. This troublesome little quarrel among the Mandalorians, it cannot continue. All that effort only to come to the same conclusion I presented in an extensive report about the hidden chain assault on Ord Mantell. Darth Zarian is right. This war among the Mandalorians cannot be allowed to spread further. We will end it if we must, by any means necessary. Is this why you were so desperate for my attention? You're afraid of the Mandalorians' war? Fear is irrelevant. These Mandalorians on both sides encroach where they are not welcome. We make no allowances for anyone, no matter how powerful their allies. The truth of the matter is, we have given those who are still loyal to Shea Vizsla ample opportunity to deal with this issue. What can you tell us about their progress? Can Mandalore guarantee an end to the war before our hand is forced? Shay and I will discuss your concerns. I would appreciate it if you could hold off on any rash decisions until then. Whatever that is, certainly it can wait. It cannot. I apologize, but we'll have to end the meeting here. I see. You must understand this is not a conversation to be left unresolved for long. Do I make myself clear? We will reconvene very soon.
It's me. I think I just found a way to get Darth Maul's holocron away from Hedda. You think? Well, we won't know if it's a solid lead until we look into it, will we? I can't give you all the details over Holocon. Too many ears listening. Meet me on Mekshaw. When you get here, stop by the Slugfall Cantina. I'll leave you something to help find me. I'll be ready for your next order.
you made it. Not that I thought you wouldn't, I'm just relieved is all. Is it wise to meet here? Word could easily get back to the hidden chain. It won't. The Darmanda who didn't join had to have a tight grip on this place. Interesting trick with the signal emitters. Not something I would expect from a Jedi. I picked up a lot of things hiding out on Osis. We had to. When you don't have a lot of parts to work with, you learn to adapt. My brother and I used to hide in here a lot. Rakan was always looking for a way out of chore time at the orphanage. I liked helping out, but I also liked going on adventures with Rakan, so... I started hiding too. I used to dream about coming back here for him. My master never knew. I didn't want him to think that I was ungrateful, or that he'd made the wrong decision. You know, taking someone who kept looking backward. But I... I think he did make the wrong decision. Maybe... If I'd said it sooner, none of this would be happening. Hedda wouldn't have the holocron. She wouldn't have Rakan. What's done is done, Sahar. The only path available is forward. Focus on that. I'm trying. It doesn't matter. We're going to fix this. That holocron is dangerous. More than any of us understand. We have to get it away from Hedda. The machine that she's building... It doesn't work without Darth Null's holocron, or without the plans inside it. All we have to do is get the holocron out of there, and Hedda loses both the machine and something she never should have had in the first place. There is no we. I'm taking Null's holocron once it's in our grasp. And let it fall into the Empire's hands? You think that's any better? <sighs> None of this matters unless we actually succeed. We'll figure out the rest later. The machine is on one of Hedda's most heavily guarded ships. There's only one way on it. And that's with a specially built shuttle. One they use to round up... prisoners. Why is Hedda taking prisoners? What has that got to do with challenging Shay? Hedda thinks if she has something that no one else does, she can take on the whole galaxy. But she's wrong. The machine, it... I don't really understand how it works. Something reaches out, and it's like turning on a light or a forgotten childhood memory rushing back. If you ever thought you once felt the Force, no matter who you've become, an outlaw, a farmer, a soldier, you feel it again. Hedda said we could... I could help these people. Help them understand their connection to the Force. She said no one else would. She didn't say anything about making them fight in her war. Hedda will do anything to win. She doesn't understand the cost. She doesn't care. You had every opportunity to tell me this when you said Hedda was building a machine. Why did you lie to me? I... I don't know. Hedda thinks this machine will just awaken powerful soldiers ready to fight for her. But the people Hedda captures, the machine revealed their connection to the Force. It doesn't make them soldiers any more than they were before. But that doesn't matter to Hedda. She wanted me to just... Even if I wanted to, I don't know how to train anyone to fight. If we don't do something, a lot of innocent people will die. We have to destroy the machine. And we have to get as many of Hedda's prisoners as we can off that ship. I only want Darth Null's holocron. I have no interest in helping you alleviate whatever guilt you're suddenly feeling. We can do both. I know where we can get the shuttle that we'll need. One of the hidden chain strike teams was sent to take captives from Hara. They must not have been too careful around the huts. They've run into trouble with the local crime lord and they're stranded there. It's a long shot. But if we can get to Hara and find out where that strike team ended up, we can steal their shuttle. It'll take us right to Hara's machine. This is foolish, and there's no guarantee your plan will work. Fine. Let's say we don't take this chance. Then what? How many more ways do you think there are to get on board that ship? I'm telling you, this is it. Now or never. I don't know all the details, other than the strike team was sent to the Minbusa district. It's probably best if we head there separately. It might raise too much suspicion otherwise. I'll see you there.
Hey, good thing you're here. I've already had a few close calls. I'm waiting on a lead to meet with me. Come find us in the cantina. We have a problem. I would say so. You're going to blow our cover before we even get started. If I hadn't asked what was going on, we could have walked right into a trap. This was supposed to be simple. But it might be impossible. The Hidden Chain Strike Team assigned a Hutta have to be somewhere in this district. But... Ugh, I don't know what to do. Slaves are rebelling. The Hutt in charge here locked down everything. No one's getting in or out. How do we even start looking for that shuttle? You have to learn to adapt, and quickly. Always think three steps ahead. It's the only way to succeed. Then I guess now's your chance to show me how that's done. We came here for a reason. I don't want to stop now. Pet has ruined too many lives, and I'm not going to let her hurt anyone else. There's no going back now. You know you'll have to face the hidden chain head on. I passed the point of no return a while ago. Let's go. They might be able to tell us how to find that shuttle, and there has to be something we can do to help them. Get away! We're not part of the uprising! Tell you, Sindhu, we've got nothing to do with those thankless warm brats. First Mandalorians, now you? Those troublemakers are gonna get us all killed! None of this would be happening if everyone would just keep their heads down and their mouths shut. I don't know why anyone would think they could take on you, Sindhu, and his piles of credits. If we make a run for the shipping port, then maybe we could... Leave us alone! No, don't! Shipping port? That's gotta be where the shuttle is. We could face any number of difficulties there. Don't get complacent. If we fight the hidden chain, you'll have to do it out in the open this time. There's a chance this will get back to Heta. I know. But there's no going back now.
Sadlar! I want them ready to move as soon as we've got a way out of this muck pit. Eyes up! Eyes up! Look who's... Huh. Don't let her walk out of here! information out of them and I don't see the shell hey over here <sighs> thank the stars you took care of those mandos they came in a shuttle do you know where it is no but you let me out and I'll help you search for anything one of them has to have a security key Ah! Uh. 
While I put in this security code, you can tell me about that Mandalorian shuttle. Give her a second. That's all right. But just so you know, wherever that shuttle is, you're not getting anywhere near it in this lockdown. Get all of us out of here, and we can help you work around all the security. Thank you! Move, while we still have a chance! That's everyone. Is there somewhere safe you can go? There's a pilot commissary here that the Mandos cleared out. We'll hunker down in there. <laughs> 